my name is Kabila Busilong and I'm from South Africa and I'm a CAF General Coordinator. A CAF General Coordinator is basically the official representative of the venue and oversees the entire administration. Uh, he is obviously responsible for ensuring that every single match is perfectly organized and with all the other venues uh, in sync. On match day, uh, the general coordinator usually uh, comes to the venue six to eight hours before uh, kickoff. And when he arrives, the first thing that he does is to check uh, the pitch. You check the goalposts, the corner flags, and after you check the pitch, then we go and check the flag protocol. And that's where we look at the flags, the lines, the lineup of the flags in terms of the order. Uh, and then we check the technical areas, the benches, the team benches where the teams are going to sit, where the fourth official and the referee sit. Make sure that uh, everything is functioning, all the branding is in place. Uh, then we go up to the VIP hospitality area and we sit where the CAF president would be sitting to make sure that what would he see when he's sitting in the chair? Would everything look okay in that chair? Would the flags look okay? Would the pitch look okay from that view? And then we go to check the uh, official clock. You have, as a GC, to synchronize your watch with the official broadcaster, so you make sure that your time aligns with the broadcast time so that uh, the match can kick off at the same time. Uh, then we start preparing the dressing rooms for the teams, uh, making sure that we put uh, all the relevant information in the locker rooms for the teams. Uh, then after that, we then await for the teams to arrive at the venue. Once the teams arrive, uh, that's when the general coordinator then receives the teams and then uh, receives the start lists, which is a very crucial point in the match because that's when we know who the starting 11 is and who the substitutes are. And we put that, we put that uh, start list into the CMS system. And once we submit it through the CMS system, it goes to all the relevant stakeholders, which is the broadcasters, the media, the VIP. They get now uh, the official start list. And if within a few minutes after we submit the start list, that's when the general coordinator will then go to, uh, to do the fourth official checks. We'll go with the fourth official to each of the dressing room and ensure that all the players that are on the start list are players that are accredited to play in this tournament and we check their jersey and their accreditation to ensure that those are the specific players that are mentioned on the start list. When it comes to a final, then we usually have the you know, a medal ceremony and that's where then the GC will be involved in uh, making sure that uh, the stage and the whole protocol around the match, uh, the medal ceremony uh, takes place in the correct order um, and making sure that the tournament ends off in, in you know, a good, good atmosphere with uh, the winning team lifting the trophy.